Welcome back to Sports Extra. Danny, you spent time this week with a CSU Pueblo football player who has a lot of meaningful ink all over his body. Yeah, you know, and this, really, this story really called out to me because I recently learned a lot about, you know, my family's background, and so this really called to me. You know, there's an old saying about people wearing emotions on their sleeve. Well, for one CSU Pueblo football player, he's got a sleeve of tattoos, and he wears more than just his emotions on it. He wears his, his family's entire history. This is Max Gonzalez. He's a linebacker on the CSU Pueblo football team, and he's a guy who loves tattoos. Every single one of them has significant meaning to me. That's because when you look closely, there's a lot of detail in his tattoos. Tattoos that tell a story of his family's lineage. You know, I always get asked, you know, like, Max, like, you have an interesting look, I guess, you know, like, what are you? You know, I'm like, well, actually, I'm this, this, that, and the other, right? Um, and so I was like, that'd be kind of cool to have something that represents all of what I am and really what I'm about. So Max found an artist in Aurora and set to work on telling his family's story through the ink on his arms. My pops always called me gorilla growing up. I have some, some origins that come from Africa, actually. I wanted that to represent you know, my origins there. Moving down his arm, he's got tattoos that represent his indigenous background. You know, more of my Hispanic Mexican side with the Aztec tattoo um, being worn as like a crown among this, this woman here, uh, kind of representing like the tears she has, like the painted tears, you know, reflecting the pain of, you know, the indigenous people. He's also got railroad tracks. I'm part Scottish, you know, French, that type of stuff, um, you know, European. And when they were brought over during the Industrial Revolution, they, a lot of them worked on the railroads that eventually built this country. There's an eagle representing American freedom and blood to remind him of what's worth fighting for. You know, if my ancestors were willing to bleed for it, I'm willing to fight for it and fight for what I believe in. He literally wears his faith like a sleeve. And the story is only beginning. He has plans to continue the work reminding himself and even members of his own family how important heritage is. I definitely have some like traditional family members that are like, you know, oh, that's cool tattoo, but like not really because we're not really for tattoos. But, you know, it's even like um, some of those family members that are like, wow, like I can tell you put a lot of thought into that. Your artist did a great job of um, putting all the details into it. And um, really, it's just like, like you said, a sense of pride that comes with it. He has a tattoo of an anchor in honor of his grandfather who served in the Navy and was his family's anchor. He never covers his right arm during games. He wants the world to see the art so he can share his family's history. One day he hopes to use the tattoos to teach his own children and grandchildren about their lineage because understanding the past will help build bridges to the future. Um, I think it's essential that we all challenge ourselves to take that next step in our family lineage. And I think understanding where your origins come from is uh, essential in that process. I think that's really cool. You know, for, for me, like we found out we had some Native American ancestry mm -hmm. and it was something that I was never told about, you know, uh, growing up. And I really appreciated what Max had with his arm. It really called to me that he wanted to tell his family story like that. Uh, I know Max is watching tonight. Max, thank you so much for sitting down with us. Really cool guy, the, too. The ink and the artwork on his body is incredible. The detail, really well done. The tattoo artist did a phenomenal job yeah. on all the tattoos. And it's great to see because a lot of times people get bored and they just get tattoos. Mm -hmm. Max obviously gets tattoos for meaning.